hi guys and welcome to my channel and today in this video i'm going to explain you four bit full adder with the help of example so guys for the full video all of you stay tuned karen jetley live so guys what is four bit full adder four bit full adder is the circuit which can add two four bit binary numbers which can add to four bit binary numbers it will do the complete addition that's why we will call it as full adder so to explain it let us assume these are our two binary numbers which i want to add okay so one two three four number of bits four so the circuit which can add them completely we will call it as four bit full adder okay now guys all of you know when we add two bits okay or when whenever we add two numbers whether it is binary or it is decimal it generates two thing one is sum another thing is called as carry okay so when i add one plus one so zero is the sum and one is the carry zero is the sum and one is the carry so this carry will be used as a carry in to the next bit okay so for example i write it here as carry out so after adding these two bits what was the carry out carry out was one so this one carry out became carry in to the next bit i'll call it as carry in so now again we add them 1 plus 0 gives me 1 again 1 plus 0 again 1 so 1 plus 0 plus 0 gives me 1 so nothing to carry so carry out is 0 so again what is the carry in here also carry in is 0 0 plus 1 1 again plus 0 1 so 0 plus 1 plus 0 what we get here is 1 and what i get carry out 0 and this carry out here becomes carry in so again 0 plus 1 plus 1 okay basically it is 0 plus 1 is 1 then again 1 to it sum is 0 carry out is 1 and then again it becomes carry in here okay here nothing is there so this is the result okay so what we did we did a complete addition i generated the sum i generated the carry out and to the next bit i added carry in so the circuit which can work like this okay for the four bits we'll call it as four bit full adder so guys now let us make that circuit so guys this is the block diagram for four bit full adder okay now in the, in the in the previous part of the video we added these two numbers okay so let us assume one of the number is a another one is b and this is bit 0 of number a bit 0 bit 1 bit 2 bit 3 and similarly this is b0 b1 b2 b3 so guys now what is this a0 a0 is 1 what is a1 0 what is a2 1 what is a3 a3 is again 1 now similarly what is b0 b0 is also 1 what is b1 0 what is b2 Zero. What is B three? One. Okay. So here the first carry in we will assume it is zero because there is nothing. So obviously the carry in is zero. So now guys, how this adder works? So it will add these three. So this comes here. So one plus one plus zero. So basically one plus one. What is the sum? Sum is zero. Then what is the carry? carry is 1 so here the carry out is 1 so this carry out becomes carry in to the next one bit adder okay so again we add them 0 plus 0 gives us 0 then again 0 plus 1 gives us 1 so what will be the carry out so no carry is generated so carry out is 0 so what we get here is 0 so this 0 comes here this is zero comes here again zero plus one plus zero gives the, us the sum zero what is the carry out carry out again is zero so this zero comes here now again we add them one plus one gives us zero one zero plus one 
zero one plus zero again it gives us zero and one is the carry out okay so this comes here this comes here so when we add them so what we are getting here is one zero one one zero one zero one one zero and these are our carry outs these are our carry outs and same are our carry ins to the next part okay so guys i hope you understand it i hope you understand it here the carry in first carry in we will assume zero then this plus this one is a other is b we add this plus this plus this whatever the sum we write here and carry out we write here the same carry out will become carry in in the next adder again we add all the three bits we write sum here carry out there so guys now quickly let us add one more number so guys now let us add these two numbers where a is 111 okay so what is a a is 1 1 1 and 1 so what we get here is 1 1 1 and 1 and guys what is b b is 0 1 1 1 so b is 0 1 1 and 1 so let us do it let us do it so first carry in is 0 so what we get here is 0 plus 1 plus 0 gives me 1 what is carry out 0 so this becomes carry in for the next again 1 plus 1 gives me 0 and 1 becomes carry out so 1 plus 1 is 0 1 0 plus 1 0 1 plus 0 is same 0 and 1 becomes carry out so this comes here so 1 plus 1 gives me 1 0 1 plus 1 so what it becomes 1 as a sum and carry out also 1 okay so again we take it as carry in 1 plus 1 plus 1 gives me 1 and carry out also 1 and 1 i get here so after adding these two numbers so what is my sum my sum is 1 1 1 Zero one. So let us add them here also. So zero plus one gives me one. So then one plus one gives me zero here and generates carry here. So one plus one plus one is what? One here and again carry here. Again one plus one plus one gives me one here and again one carry which is overflow. It will come here. So what we get here is. Triple one zero one. So what we get here is triple one zero one. So guys, this extra bit, okay, this is also called as overflow. Why we call it overflow? Because the total number of bits are four, and this is the fifth bit which we are generating. So we call it as overflow. How we deal with it, and what is the science of overflow and underflow? For that, I will make another video. So guys, that's all for today. So guys if you like my videos <clears throat> please subscribe to my channel and I'll be uploading more videos related to different topics of information technology and much more so guys all of you thanks for watching and stay tuned